My name is Christine Lovely. I am uh, finishing up my clinical fellowship in hematology and oncology. I have this unique angle of being able to see both the scientific side of medicine and also the clinical side of medicine. And it's so exciting when you can see something that you've worked on in the laboratory translate into something clinically meaningful to make therapies better for patients. I um, see lung cancer patients in the clinic, and in the laboratory I study lung cancer, and specifically a, a type of lung cancer that's characterized by mutations in a gene called ALK or ALK. And the idea is if you target the ALK with a drug and block that abnormal signal, then you can effectively kill the cancer cells. Yeah, it's really fun. It's, um, it's really directly clinically translatable too because I see these patients with this mutation in clinic and then I study their disease in the laboratory. And I mean, oftentimes, and the best thing we can do is actually get their tumor sample and study their tumor directly rather than just you know, using cell models or mouse models. So I think Vanderbilt, we have wonderful resources for sequencing, for this, what we call next generation sequencing, the kind of newest cutting edge technology. But not only do we have the technology, but we have the people to be able to translate that information into the clinic. So it's one thing to be able to study something in the laboratory, it's something very different to be able to take that information and then bring it to the clinic and make meaningful therapies, and not only the clinical side, but also we have wonderful bioinformatics here to be able to assist in dealing with this enormous quantity of data that sequencing is going to contain. So I grew up on Long Island, New York, um, about 25 miles from Manhattan. I had never been to the South before. It's easy to live here. I can live really close to the hospital and the lab, which is just makes your life easier when you live close. You don't have to worry about commuting on the subway or the bus. So I found Nashville great. I think the people here are so nice. And that was actually another thing that really attracted me to Vanderbilt. When I came from my interview, when I was finishing medical school, just the people that you see you know, as you're interviewing, the people who are walking you around from interview to interview, they're just so nice and so pleasant. And they really stay with you throughout your time as a resident. Um, so you just feel like people care about you, not only as a physician, but also as a person. And you believe that they're invested in your best interest. I feel like I was extremely well-trained um, as an internal medicine resident with a broad spectrum of different patients and different diagnoses. I think the research opportunities here are top-notch and there's wonderful mentors uh, for people to work with um, that will help you be successful at every point in your career. I think there's a real um, desire for people to be collaborative, interactive, and successful. I think there's a, this idea that the whole is greater than the sum of the parts and that you know if we're one person is successful that we're all successful.